Hey everybody back again as I continue to uh, go through and show you all my card collection year by year and as you can see in front of you I have my 1957 Topps cards. So I'm just going to go ahead and start up here in the left hand corner with uh, numerically looking at the Robin Roberts from that set. Nice Sherm Lawler. Typically looking to get these in an excellent mid 6 to near mid 7 range. This is the uh, the first year the tops went to that standard card uh, size that we still see today. Went from the little larger ones that they had in 56 down to these standard size. They went to full color photography on these instead of having any painted image or painted backgrounds. Skill Hodges in a seven. That Ashburn and Banks in the fives. Like I said, some of the commons, a couple commons in here you'll see in the seven. Bob Lemon Hall of Famer. Ken Boyer go on to win the MVP in 64. A couple of commons here. Hall of Famer Hoyt Wilhelm. Charlie Neal was a pretty good player for the LA Dodgers. A recent pickup of the Eddie Matthews and also these Dodger Sluggers. And then uh, 57. Uh, the good thing about the set is it's got a lot of high quality Hall of Fame rookies. So there's five Hall of Fame rookies cards in this set. Uh, starting here with this Don Drysdale. Love that it shows him in that Brooklyn Dodgers cap. That was uh, the year they moved to Brooklyn. And Bill Mazeroski, another big Bill Mazeroski collector. So I just picked this up on a five years ago. I am a big Frank Robinson collection. Got this in excellent mid six. Although I might, you know, I, I would love to. This card's really taken off in value too lately. Love to have gotten this in a seven, but just never got around to it. Then the, the Rocco or Rocky Calavito. This card, excellent in six. He's the only one of these uh, last cards I'm showing that isn't a Hall of Famer, but he was a, a fan favorite power hitter throughout his whole career and uh, just didn't have a very long career, I guess, maybe to, to get to that 500 home run plateau. Then uh, a popular card from this set, the Brooks Robinson, because it is a short print card from that set and hard to get, and an Airman 7. And then a really sharp looking Jim Bunning. Uh, and that's a pretty decent uh, it's I appeal for excellent at six. But uh, just a quick glance at my 1957 Tops cards. Once again, I appreciate your posts and comments, and I'll talk to you again soon.